Oh, wow! It's Darius Quan, a real live star! If you're looking for guns, the Ooh, sanctified Piscatelli has success. Hey, strangers. Randy's the name. Automobiles are the game. Flab's master mechanic, they call me. How can I help? Oh, shucks. Don't know who you heard that from, but I suppose I'm all right. What I lack in experience, I make up for in pluck. And I suppose imagination as well. While other fellas dream of beautiful women, I've been in love with cars for as long as I can remember. Uh, not in that way, of course. <laughs> Not particularly. It's boring work. I only get pulled in if something breaks that a tender can't fix, so I spend most of my time just waiting here, like I'm doing now. But beggars can't be choosers. No offense, but you're a gamble in a hard luck casino. Don't like working in the bazaar, but it's constant money, and I need that right now. See? I was working in the lab late one night when my eyes beheld an eerie sight. For my monster from his slap began to rise. Some months ago, my dad wrote me that he thought he'd seen folks skulking around our homestead. I dismissed it. Our place has always been isolated and safe. Stupid. Turns out it was a small band of one of them crazy planes gangs. They sent me a letter. My parents are dead, and they're holding my kid brother and sister hostage. I ain't even close to having enough money to pay the ransom. I mean, if I did, I suspect they'd just kill us all after I pay. So what's a guy to do? I'm not one to condone violence, but I've heard of what you folks have been doing all across Colorado. Whatever you think is needed. Let me show you where to find our old homestead. I'll meet you there. You help out the Get family and I'll work for you, no doubt about it. See you there. Don't take too long, okay? With the vocal. I got the cold cut. Yo, what the hell's You should get something hot to drink for the trip home.
Really need to ask Piscatelli to look at my gun. Ah, bugger keeps jamming. You made it! Thanks for helping out the old Get family. Homestead is right up the road. This man's been torn apart. Oh, look! Wolverine tracks.
I think we got a live one here. Who are you? You're not my family. You go away now. I'm sorting through dreams for my brother. Um, unless you have some more candies? Root beer flavored dreams for my brother. He's real nice. Randy. He always said we'd build us a place one day. Me, mommy, daddy, and him. We'll all live up in the blue sky together. He has to come back first, though. Do you want some of these? They're my very last ones. The gummies say it's okay to chew on them. It's respectful. And they taste so sweet. Okay. More candies for Anita. Bad men came from the flatlands. Mummy and Daddy left. Then the doggies came for the candy and Mummy and Daddy and the bad men are gone, but there's lots of candy. As broke as a dropped plate. Maybe we should put her out of her misery. Don't shout at me! I'll come, I'll come! You won't melt like mommy and daddy, right? I didn't like it. Except for the jump ropes they made me. That was okay. I like those. Um, can I bring them? so mean, are you? We can be friends. Do you want to be friends? I'll teach you how to talk to the moon, okay? But you have to be real quiet. Real quiet. And you gotta eat a few dreams first. Is that you? I don't know how to thank you, Rangers. My, my little sister, safe and sound and all in one piece, but... Wait. What about everyone else? you were gonna say that but at least you saved Nita I I am grateful for that come on sis you're safe now you're okay let's get you somewhere warm yeah 
Thank you again, Rangers. Once I get her settled in, I'll come over to your base. I don't know if you still need a mechanic, but, well, it's the least I can do. Ah! I can't believe you brought Nita back to me, Rangers. Hey, say thanks, Nita. My brother's dreams are sorted. Got any candy? <laughs> um, I'm ah! sure she meant thanks. Let's see you at base, Rangers. I can't believe you brought Nita back to me. Can't believe you brought Nita back to me, Rangers. Hey, say thanks, Nita. My brother's dreams are sorted. Got any candy? strangling yarn. <laughs> this one about an astute student who learned how to love to kill. Once there was a little boy who loved having pets. Oh yes, cats, dogs, squirrels, badgers. He loved them all. And he especially loved them in a nice big stew with a sprig of thyme. It wasn't until the boy met little Annie that he began to develop other interests. He began to ply little Annie with gifts. Trinkets and tidbits from scrapyards wrapped in animal furs. Soon, little Annie came to love the boy and agreed to see him away from the adults. Thus, that little boy had finally lured his first human victim into his snare, his first trophy for his box of many knives. 